Hey there, good people of the internet. Welcome, welcome. This is Ken. This is uh, the Ken Burton Show, I guess. And guess what we're doing? The chemist. Now, <laughs> I've already got the M13B, right? A couple of guys uh, helped me get it. And to be frank, I felt really guilty. And the reason is because they did most of the work, right? So I was pretty determined and this must be my 30th, 40th attempt at getting the chemist. So, <laughs> sorry, but it, it is. And, uh, you know, I'm not going to lie about it. I, it took me this long to do the chemist on my own. And this is my attempt at the chemist. I felt really bad that these these two guys, they just, they, they tranced everything that was anywhere near us. So it was relatively easy to get the M13B. And I felt like I cheated. Oh, you cheeky bastard. What are you doing? Cheeky sod. Oof, you're out of there. Um, so I was pretty determined to do it on my own. So I thought I'd give it a go. And this, guys, is me getting the chemist and uh, very badly. <laughs> I've watched loads of videos on this, right? I still maintain this is the best part of the map to get the chemist um, because it's certainly the easiest in my view. I mean, a lot of people are doing it from the tower on another side of the map and I guess that's fine. But for me, I, I felt that this was easier. Now, I've cut this down because it did take me a while. <laughs> but like everyone says, you've got to you've got to have patience, you know. For me, this building is the best place to go and attack the chemist from all right easy as that uh you are very very partially in the radiation and i've just cut that bit there because you didn't want to see me pissing around really so uh i know for a fact that uh there's going to be a load of uh, bots over there and the reason being is if you have a look where the radiation is coming just through the wall, if you go and stand in that bit, then the chemist will come to you. All right. Easy as that. Now, I take out as many of these guys as I possibly can. Um, and this is what usually gets me down. I have I have killed the chemist before, but the only problem is I then couldn't get away and... <laughs> was in a right mess and a bit of a panic and you'll see that I'm in a bit of a panic the way I do this one as well so I can see these guys I can see where they are even through the smoke this is my setup sniper rifle and uh, I'm, do I'm doing okay you know it's it's going okay but I know for a fact that any second now we are going to see the chemist <clears throat> I know this because I've done it before. I've seen it before. I've I've been through this scenario, and there he is. Oh, few bugger! Straight headshot. He's dead, guys. Single headshot. Took out the chemist, and I got him. He's down. He's dead. Now all hell breaks loose because all of his cohorts uh, come to you to try and kill you to stop you from getting the gun. Now I was very patient i spent a little while sat on this roof just camping just taking out as many of these guys as i could leaving myself as much time as possible and with as many gas masks as possible to go and get the gun oh oh jesus <laughs> i nearly shit myself when he came upstairs <laughs> Right, another gas mask. I need probably two, maybe three, uh, in case it gets stuck. So we'll get as many as we can and uh, we'll just go in the middle of it and see what we can do. Now, I did sit on this roof quite a while, so let's just cut that. I think it's the last bot. I think. The last one that's chasing me anyway. I've taken all the rest out. There he is. Oh, you bugger, you're out of there. And I am going to now go for the run. Let's just take that gas mask as well. Let's go and do the run. Now, I was a bit disheartened when I got to <laughs> I got to a certain point because I saw a bot running out of a building. And I thought, shit, he's the guy that's going to kill me. He is the guy that's going to kill me. And there he is running out of the building. But he's too stupid to shoot me. I've got the gun. The M13B from the chemist is now mine 
all I need to do is get the fuck out of Dodge. <laughs> and here's where panic sets in. Uh, now, I wasn't very calm and collected. Some bots did try and get me earlier on in the game uh, and activity increased in the area. They turned up in this vehicle. I'm going to take this vehicle. Now I've got to find an exfil. Guys, this is the furthest I have ever got. Exfil, I don't notice that there's one underneath me. I'm heading for that one there. Wrong. And not only that, but I'm stopping. Whenever I open up the map, I d I'm either going to drive into a wall or I'm t something's going to happen. Fortunately and unfortunately, I see the green smoke. But what I notice is that that green smoke is in the worst fucking place it could possibly be. I never successfully exfil from this location. Always. They come at me from all angles. Um, they bots just appear to the right of you and you know it's just it's just horrendous but in this particular case potentially I might be okay I'm in the right spot I'm pretty confident there's th this is why I'm looking to the right of me I've had bots literally spawn in the green stuff before so let's do the first one I'm not particularly used to this weapon or the setup on this weapon and in any minute now one of them's going to come over the branch and take me down all right bombs away but one of them is going to take me down I have a self revive but he runs straight past me. Normally in these circumstances, he would kill me. He runs straight past me. I can take him out. The helicopter's come in. I pop some smoke. I'm on the helicopter. Guys, the relief at doing this on my own after maybe 30, 40 attempts, I can't tell you. It, I was overjoyed, elated. And that is the glory of this game. One of the glories of this game. Guys, as ever, I will see you on the dark side. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave a comment in the comments section. And uh, yeah, enjoy your DMC. Friend me. And you guys take it all easy. I'll see you soon. Take care.